Gary Neville laid into Kobe Mainu as Liverpool ran rings around Manchester United's midfield, claiming his first half positioning, defied logic. England's latest star lined up at Old Trafford for Sunday's Crunch Premier League clash, which ended 2-2. United fans were desperate for a response after watching their side concede two late goals to lose 4-3 at Chelsea on Thursday. But, after having an Alejandro Garnacho strike disallowed for offside, United ended up conceding a soft goal from a Liverpool corner. The visitors continued to dominate the ball, helping themselves to 14 attempts before the break. United, who had zero shots, could not get near them in midfield. Read more in FOOTBALLNOTA keeper Southgate Scouts England star in Derby, but he is involved in blunder goal hot wheels win a stunning Mercedes G-Wagon plus £5,000 from just 89p with our code and Neville took aim at Mainu as he criticised the youngster for failing to do the basics of the game. Neville said, look where Mainu is there, he's ahead of the ball at the throw-in. As a central midfield player, I always think you've got to run back. Fellow pundit Jamie Carragher interjected, there's a man marking system, no doubt he's got his eye on Mac Allister. Neville replied, forget about that, forget about Mac Allister, don't be ahead of the ball, get up to that one, he's moving up there now. Most read in football Zobbyland England fans at Euros told to book hotels on street with zombie drug addicts tough luck Everton hit with another two-point deduction after breaking PSR rules stick it all on red. Supercomputer predicts title winners after United Dent Liverpool hopes title race how Arsenal, Man City and Liverpool's Prem title race run-ins compare best free bet sign-up offers for UK bookmaker Carragher stated, it must be an instruction before the game. Neville added, it defies logic, it's the basics of the game. Even now he's chasing him across the pitch, he doesn't need to. Watch Bruno Fernandes score from inside centre circle after horror gaff gifts Man United way back into Liverpool clash, Garnacho and Hodgland can deal with that, look at the space in behind him. That space alongside Casemiro there. Just the basics, look at where Casemiro's gone in, Mainu, they've both gone in. It opens up a path into there. Honestly, it's basics. Absolute basics, so easy to play against Manchester United's midfield. Fans also reacted to Neville's criticism of Mainu. One said, Neville's right about Mainu, this man-to-man -man marking system is why we're getting so cut open, needs to hold his position. Another declared, he's marking Mac Allister then there's half a space behind him for Diaz and Robertson to run into. One noted, Neville is absolutely spot on, why is Mainu man marking Mac Allister like that and leaving that massive gap in midfield? Another added, Neville is completely correct, Mainu is being used in such a strange way here. Constantly ahead of the ball and having absolutely no impact on the game. Mainu ended up having the last laugh though.
with Bruno Fernandes pulling United back on level terms in the 50th minute with a wonder strike from the centre circle, Mainu then made a positive impact as he put the hosts ahead 15 minutes later. Virgil van Dijk and Andy Robertson were left arguing with each other after Mainu sliced Liverpool's midfield apart with a silky run. He laid the ball off before receiving it just inside Liverpool's box. The 18-year-old turned on his axis before curling a shot in the top corner. But there was late drama as Liverpool won a penalty in the 81st minute. Read more Sun S-T-O-R-I-E-S-R-A-I-L-Y Clever I live in a council house and my decluttering hack is so good it saves hours Tricky Exit Love Islands Page slams claim she faked Finn split to do X on the beach Aaron Juan Bissaka fouled Harvey Elliott in United's area, and the spot kick was duly put away by Mo Salah. Neither side was able to find a decisive goal though as the match ended 2-2.